if you got an electric hot water tank, there are now technologies that you can have the solar to actually generate the hot water. And hot water is an expensive part of your house energy footprint. So how does that work? The hot water was not really a, a thing that we used to consider because the off-peak rates were obviously so low that it was viable just to keep it on off-peak. But those off-peak rates are, are rising. There's a few products around that we can use now to, to have the solar feeding into the, the hot water tank. So we've got IO controls on some of the inverters. We've also got the catch power system where it can divert the exported solar energy so rather than exporting it to the grid for five or six cents you can have that energy stored into your hot water system so it becomes a sort of a semi-thermal battery where you're storing that energy as heat inside your hot water tank so you're using that energy during the day to really maximize your energy independence from the grid as well